Hi, my name is Andy Warhol, and I was an amazing pop artist who experienced many adventures. From my childhood of staying home sick all the time, to going to an artist college, and then on to an outstanding career, I will always be known as one of the top pop artists. I was the finest pop artist of all time. I was born on August 6, 1928 in Pittsburgh. I was one of I was one of the three sons of Andrew and Julie Warhol. My brothers were John and Paul Warhol. My father was an astonishing coal miner. In third grade, I experienced St. Vitus dance, which is a nervous disease that causes involuntary movements. During this time, because of this, I was home a lot. During this time, I collected pictures of famous stars. This would influence my later career as a pop artist. When I was old enough, I attended the School of Fine Arts at Carnegie Institute of Technology. Until I became a pop artist, I designed magazine illustrations and unusual ink drawings. I, finally, I became a pop artist in my late 20s and early 30s. I created a place called The Factory in New York. The Factory did not only produce my artwork, but was also a meeting place for all people of New York in a filmmaking studio. In the 1960s, I started painting everyday objects like Campbell's soup can and Coca-Cola bottles. I also painted pictures of Marilyn Monroe, Mick Jagger, and many more celebrities. In 1968, I was almost killed by a former worker but survived. In 1968, I mean, in 1960, then in 1969, I started a magazine called Interview. Then, I also published a book called The Philosophy of Andy Warhol in 1975. I died on February 22nd, 1987 after a gallbladder surgery. Because of my success in pop art, I have my own museum in my hometown of Pittsburgh. From being home every day to going to the top college for an artist, and then on to a huge career as an artist. I was one of the finest pop artists. I showed the world that art can be found in everyday objects.